there is this rather stupid argument in America, and one we've been having a long time, is health care a right or just another product we buy like everything else? I say it's a stupid argument because of course it's a right. If your car breaks down on the side of the road, you blow a tire or run out of gas, nobody comes to help, nobody fixes your car until you prove you can pay. But if you break down on the side of the road, we'll send an ambulance, two EMTs in the back, take you to the nearest hospital and treat you until you're ready to leave. Now they hope you'll pay, but you don't have to pay first. And that's the only real argument we have about health care in America. How do we pay for it? I don't know if all these plans being tossed around now are the right plans or not, but I do know we need something better than what we have now. A lot of people say they don't want government-run health care, and yet every major city in America has a government-supported public hospital, and we all pay for that. A lot of people say they don't want to lose their employer insurance. Take mine. I pay thousands in monthly premiums, thousands more in deductibles and co-pays, and yet when I had a broken tooth pulled, my insurance company wouldn't pay to knock me out, so I did. I think that's the first documented case of an insurance death panel. Insurance companies are not your friend, they never have been. Their goal is to make a profit, so they treat your health like that broken down car. We have an incredible number of dedicated doctors and nurses in this country who are entitled to every dollar they make. The nurses deserve more. But the healthcare industry has been scamming us long enough. They make up their charges, they pad the bill so the insurance company will pay a little more, and you pay the rest. I don't know if all these plans being tossed around now are the right plans or not, but I do know we need something better than what we have now, not just because it's a right, but because it's the right thing to do.